The 5 Series has long served as BMW's middle child sedan, offering a just right size for buyers who can't fit a 7 Series in their parking spot and for whom the 3 Series feels a bit too cramped. The upcoming new generation of the 5 Series doesn't deviate from this Goldilocks storyline, and it offers a spacious cabin filled with luxuries. The 5 Series' new digital dashboard features BMW's iDrive 8.5 interface, and the company's hands-free driver assistance system is available too. Our chief complaint about the previous Generation 5 was that it sacrificed some of its athletic road manners in the name of comfort. But BMW has figured out a way to engineer some of that driver-first ethos back into its sedans. Although the current 5 Series is still relatively fresh, receiving its most recent revision only a couple of years ago, this ground-up redesign is intended to keep it competitive against rivals such as the Audi A6, the Genesis G80, and the Mercedes-Benz E-Class, the last of which has also been fully redesigned this year. BMW is preparing the next-generation 5 Series sedan together with an all-electric i5 variant, as well as the performance-oriented M5 Sports sedan. Look for the new four-door and dealer lots in early 2024. For 2024, the 5 Series will be offered in 530i, 540i, and 550e guises, with the 530i getting a 255hp turbocharged 2.0-liter four-cylinder and either rear or all-wheel drive. The 540i comes with all-wheel drive standard as well as a 375hp turbocharged inline-six. Both are augmented by a 48-volt hybrid system. At our test track, the all-wheel drive 530i xDrive hit 60 mph in 5.5 seconds. BMW says the 540i should be powerful enough to hit 60 mmHs in 4.5 seconds. The plug-in hybrid 550e is powered by an inline-six and an electric motor that combine for 483 horsepower. All-wheel drive is standard. The ride is smooth, but the 530i still provides a sense of subtle athleticism. Cornering grip is generous, especially with the M Sport package's upgraded suspension. Speaking of the M Sport package, it also adds better brakes, which resulted in a heroic 156-foot stop from 70 Memi Rapric at our test track. Interior dimensions have increased a bit, so there should be plenty of room for adult riders to get comfortable in the front and rear seats of the 5 Series, and the cabin looks appropriately deluxe. While genuine leather upholstery remains an option, BMW has included a vegan-friendly option called Veganza this time around. All models come with an automatic climate control system with vents that are cleverly integrated into the dashboard design to hide them from view. A tilt-and-slide sunroof is standard, but you can also opt for a large fixed glass roof that extends into the rear seat area. The optional luxury seating package adds heated and ventilated front seats with more power adjustments and a massage feature. The premium package adds a heated steering wheel, a head-up display, and more. And the executive package adds the panoramic glass roof as well as power rear sunshade, glass interior controls, and an interior camera. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.